Immigration is the taboo subject of this election. Some people think we're being deluged by foreigners coming over here and taking jobs which otherwise would be done by British people. So for our second discussion, keeping three perfectly good British opinion formers out of work, we have three foreigners. <laughs> but we're not going to talk about immigration because that's racist. <laughs> Instead, we're going to get their view on the renown in which the British electoral system is held around the world. Please welcome French author and commentator Agnes Poirier, self-styled German comedy ambassador Henning Vane, and SKP from the land of the free, Rich Hall. <laughs> so, thank you all for coming, you, you bunch of foreigners. And, uh, Agnes, what do you make of our system? You've, you've lived here quite a while. What do you make of the British political system? Well, it's been some interesting weeks because it seems the British have been playing at I want to be a revolutionary, I'm going to vote Lib Dem, I'm going to break the system. And look at tonight, it seems that Lib Dem, I mean, it's a souffle that has gone flat. And the British have chickened out in the polling booth. And, yeah. uh, a lot of, of food. A... Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Speak of a revolution, I yeah. mean, an old Etonian is going to be in Downing Street tomorrow. So you say we, be we basically, we we're cowards. We were just, well, we were just sort of, it's just like we had a wild youth, we dressed up as hippies, we briefly experimented with marijuana, and now we're all back to voting Tory like the losers we are. <laughs> um, so is that what you'd expect from us, that kind of inherent... Refusal to change. <laughs> well, it's quite admirable. It's quite funny also to watch for the French. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, that's a, it's a great consolation to be making the French laugh. Um, <laughs> but, but Rich, uh, yes. 